Welcome to another episode of the Outdoor Voice YouTube channel. Today, we're gonna to talk about ninja discrimination. Yes, here in the Commonwealth of Virginia, there are many laws designed to discriminate against those people who choose to self-identify as ninjas. Virginia Code 18.2308 specifically bars the concealment of ninja throwing stars, nunchucks, and shurikens. I'm gonna do something to try to make this Commonwealth of Virginia a little bit more open, a little bit more tolerant of those of the ninja orientation. We are going to build a ninja throwing star bandolier so that you can legally and openly express yourselves as ninjas. In addition to fighting anti-ninja discrimination, we're also gonna be giving away some epic prizes. Lots of ninja weapons are gonna be given away. So stay tuned. At the end of this video, I'm gonna show you guys how you can win, what you can win, all the details. All right, let's get started. First things first, we're gonna need some harness leather and lots of it. There we go. There is a big chunk of cow skin right there, folks. Last year when I came home with 50 pounds of tanned harness leather, my wife questioned whether I needed it all. I think those of you who follow my channel will agree that it's been a good buy. So let me show you how my open carry ninja throwing star bandolier system works. If you take your ninja throwing stars and you put them away and conceal them and put them in your pocket, you have committed a class one misdemeanor in the state of Virginia, punishable by up to 12 months in jail. So to avoid legal issues, our ninja friends can now open carry their ninja throwing stars, which is perfectly legal now. Yes, this magnetic bandolier system allows you to uh, store your throwing knives, your small and full-size ninja throwing stars, and you are just ready to go. Look at this. In fact, any of your throwing weapons can be stored on the magnetic ninja throwing star bandolier system. There you go. There's even a space down here for your throwing sticks and uh, a little sheath built in for more throwing knives. Look at that, isn't that nice? Now, I know you guys are thinking this is one sexy piece of ninja wear, but it's not just fashionable, it's functional too. So let's take this out to our ninja throwing star throwing range and see how it performs. Aha, you didn't see me coming because of my ninja skills. Yeah, that's right. And remember, it's not just about ninja throwing stars. Woohoo!
Now, one of the great things about this Ninja Throwing Star bandolier system is it's so versatile. If you're super ripped like me or Dwayne Johnson, you can often get poked by these larger Ninja Throwing Stars because they, they stick out over the side of the bandolier. So you can go down to half size Ninja Throwing Stars and they fit quite comfortably on the bandolier and you won't get poked when you're doing ninja rolls or climbing through air ducts to assassinate your foes. Now remember, nothing ever says that you have to use Ninja Throwing Stars. You can use shudokens, throwing knives, throwing sticks, katanas, size, commas, whatever you like. Just remember, mix and match your bandolier to your social and assassination needs. And as always, don't forget your throwing sticks. Whether wearing them in your hair or openly in your bandolier, they're a great little weapon. Oh man, I promised you I'd do a giveaway and we're going to do just that. I'm going to give away this bandolier with a set of Ninja Throwing Stars and the axes and the throwing sticks to one of you subscribers. Just make sure you're a subscriber, click share, share this video on any website, social media platform, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, whatever, and leave a comment. Something ninja related or a funny joke or give me a good suggestion for future videos and my favorite comment. I will go and give this bandolier system to that person, okay? But that's not all. If I can get 10,000 likes, I'm gonna give away some of my extra Ninja Throwing Stars. If you're under 18, I'm not gonna be sending this stuff to you without your parents' permission first. And if they say no, we'll, we'll work something out. We'll make sure you get some sort of prize. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. You thought it was, it was fun. If you wanna see more videos like this, make sure you click that like button. And don't forget to click subscribe and click that bell button so you get notified when we put out new videos. We put out new videos every Saturday morning. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.